Hey, so I've had a lot of really great questions come in this week from clients and um, I decided that I would go ahead and do a quick video to discuss um, some of the things that have come up in these conversations that I thought maybe more people might want to be aware of as well. So um, the topic that I wanted to share in this video is about being able to make a choice to let's just say vibrate higher when things are going really bad um, when things are not working out when you feel like you're not in the flow when you're constantly being triggered, when you're realizing that you're being course corrected because maybe you made a choice earlier that was not in your best interest, even though you thought it was, and then now you're being course, what I call course corrected into the right vibration, onto the right path, then it's very easy to become extremely self-critical, self-judgmental, to dive into a pit and want to stay there. I think the want to stay there comes from the 3D consciousness because it says, you know what? I'm familiar with where we are, been here before, um, it feels good to be mad. Um, it's fulfilling. It's satisfying, right? But here's the thing. The longer you stay in the pit of despair, victimhood, anger, fear, whatever it is that you're dealing with, the longer it takes before you actually get back into your groove. So, and I'm, I'm actually really speaking this from experience because the past couple weeks, I have been reminded so many times with little things that I should be praising, whether it be creator, you know, if you call them God, whatever you want to say, your spirit guides, your angels, all of them. I have days where I actually call it be mad, you know, I'm mad at spirit day. Um, because 3D wise, I just need to have that moment. And I'm not proud of it, but I do. I do do that. And, um, and I just want to say that the past couple weeks, Spirit has really been challenging me with all these little things going on. Like, like me thinking, okay, I'm in a groove. This is great. And then a key breaks in the lock. Or you put a new lock on and you are missing the two screws that actually hold the mechanism together. I could go on. It's been, a, it's been fun. Um, and so many opportunities for me to just go back into that are you serious you know mentality because sometimes I gotta say you know when you are a light worker and you feel like you are doing a lot of good for other people and this planet when things don't go smoothly it's real easy to go seriously <laughs> why why and I, I will step up and say, yes, I have done that myself. Um, but we are, I think we are learning. I know I am. That sometimes you just have to praise God, um, your spirit guides. Even when you are in the depths of darkness and depths of despair, um, frustration, you know, again, anger. And every time the past couple days I've made better choices to actually go okay 
I can see, can you, would you please show me what is in my best interest in this moment to do then? Maybe show me another option. And they never let me down, man. They came through and they came through really quickly too. So I just wanted to share that with you. Um, cause I have been talking with some of my friends and my clients about it this week. I'm not the only one dealing with this. So I wanted to just do a short video to just be like, you know what, if this is you, if this resonates with you, then challenge yourself instead of complaining, um, getting angry, being like spirit, seriously, what the, hmm, you know, <laughs> um, vibrate higher and just be like, you know what? This is working out. I know it's working out because I know that I am pulling a whole lot more in positively than what is trying to come against me right now. Um, I can thrive through this situation and um, yeah, see what happens. So, okay. I hope this helps you guys. Let me know. I always like to hear your feedback. All right. Bye. Have a good day.